serious? Are you really gonna buy us lunch? Yeah, arriving any minute. Kalia, you are the bomb, girl. <gasps> this thing, no. I can smell the fish and chips. Oh, you see my butt, girl? Go say it. It's right. Y'all delivery for PPA. Hey! I'll be right back. It's the band. Uh, let me know when lunch arrives. Music. Camille, oh, good to see you. Mwah. This is Camille Naked, the founder of Caribbean Southern Stars Steel Drum Band. Great to have you guys here at the Folly. Oh, nice thanks. See you. Camille, can you tell us what is steel drums? Oh, steel drums is um, originated in, in the Caribbean, the island of Trinidad and Tobago. It was first developed by the African youth. And during the time of the, the war, when the Americans came, they left a lot of gallon drums that they used to yeah. store oil in. So they, used, they took it and they found that if they hollowed it out, they can actually make a sound from it. Yeah, how does sound come from something that's made of steel? Well, you have to heat it up. It's a, a heating process and you pound it so that you get the different shapes here. Mm -hmm. And depending on how you pound it, yep. you get a different sound from the notes. So this here would, I've put the notes here so you can yeah, see. Yeah, so that's, that's an A. That would be an A, an A, that's a C. Okay. You have different notes depending on where you go. Okay, so can I give it a go? Yeah, of course. Okay, so. Yep, very good. Are all these pans the same? No, they're quite different. This is a double tenor and this is a single tenor. This one carries a full range of notes and it can also carry the melody. We also have the cello in the back there and the double second in the back and the full length of the drum is the bass. So it's like a full-on band. Yeah, it's an orchestra really, if yeah. you look at it. Are these expensive? They're very expensive. A single tenor would be, say, uh, in New Zealand dollars, about 1,500 New Zealand dollars. And what was the reason behind you bringing your traditional music here to Aotearoa? Well, I thought New Zealand music needed a bit of a rev up. Okay. I, think, I think they needed a bit of um, some color. And um, we see that the Pacific people have really made their culture strong here, their music. And we thought, well, Caribbean people have been here since 1960s and we haven't really brought our music yeah. here. And I thought it's time we actually introduced our Caribbean music to New Zealand. And one thing I also love about you guys is the look, the shirts. Do you guys have one for me today? Yes, we bought one for you. Nice. That's what I'm talking about. Camille, thank you so much for coming by the house and sharing your culture with us today. We would love it if um, you guys could share some of your music with us. Oh, we'd be delighted. You guys ready? Yay! Yay! <laughs> hey, thanks for being with us today. Keep checking out our website for more Pacific Beat Street. We're going to leave you now with Caribbean Southern Star Steel Drum Band. Have a great week. And I do believe our lunch has arrived. Woo! Bye. Bye. This program was made with funding from New Zealand on air.